okay so the next topic is with regard to african cheetahs okay so with regard to african cheetahs um recently there was like there was a lift of the stay um with from the supreme court with regard to the introduction of uh, cheetahs uh, from namibia to india so that's why this particular news uh, this particular uh, species of african cheetahs was there in the news now we know it was in 1952 uh, that the cheetahs or the asiatic cheetahs in um, our country it was uh, declared to be extinct in our country in 1952 and uh, since then we have like the indian government have um, tried for introducing like test tried tried out for various efforts for introducing uh, the cheetah back into our ecosystem okay for that um, you know now the asiatic cheetah it is found uh, only that is it is found in the wild today only in the country of iran and uh, since iran didn't encourage our efforts to reintroduce uh, asiatic cheetah from iran to our country our focus uh, turned out to africa but in 2013 supreme court uh, rejected the idea of introducing cheetah from namibia to uh, india citing that this particular african cheetah it would uh, turn out to be essentially a uh, alien species and it would not have a certain prey base for its survival so uh, supreme court halted or it uh, stayed the proposal of reintroduction of cheetahs to our country but uh, recently supreme court lifted this stay uh, citing that the African cheetahs, it can be uh, introduced from Namibia to our country on experimental basis. Okay, so uh, among the areas, that is, uh, among the areas which are identified for introduction of this African cheetah to our country, it is mainly being introduced in the Kuno National Park. So, you need to take down this or you need to note uh, about this Kuno National Park which is situated in Madhya Pradesh. So, okay. So, it is actually um, carried out under a 14 crore project, which is known as Project 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 Cheetah. A 14 crore project, Project Cheetah. And it is being released by NTCA. Okay. This particular fund of uh, 14 crore for the reintroduction of Cheetah into a country is being released or uh, the funding is being released by NTCA or National Tiger Conservation Authority and uh, according to the proposal a total of 10 African cheetah including 5 males and 5 females are being brought from Namibia to this Kuno National Park for uh, relocation and uh, the Kuno National Park it is uh, having a uh, very diverse uh, prey base for this particular african cheetah like four horned antelope stingara then wild boar spotted deer all these are present so it is um, expected to be uh, having a wide uh, prey base for the african cheetahs and with regard to the conservation status keep in mind the asiatic cheetah they are critically endangered we know the asian uh, Asiatic cheetah they are found or uh, they are found in the wild only in the country of Iran at present so it is critically endangered as per the IUCN red list and uh, what is the purpose of reintroduction or why is it important to relocate certain species when they are found to be extinct uh, in that particular locality see when species are threatened or when they are endangered or when they are found to be extinct in the wild then they are uh, being reintroduced uh, from some other areas to that particular area and this is mainly done to bring back that healthy ecosystem or to bring back the diverse characteristic of the ecosystem and for bringing back the uh, thriving population of that particular species which has gone extinct in wild in that particular area and by bringing back or by this uh, relocation it improves its habitats its ecosystem function and this becomes ex especially important when it is uh, in the case of an apex predator like uh, cheetah which is which has got its place in the um, apex 
level in the food chain that, that is in the highest trophic level of the food chain. It is also potential to improve our tourism sector and also there is one uh, challenge which is being faced uh, because of the relocation that is if there is a lack of prey base for this particular uh, species when it is reintroduced that is we know African cheetah. Uh, it is it can turn out to be an alien species so when it is reintroduced or uh, when it is introduced to our ecosystem there if there is a challenge of lack of prey base then this particular reintroduction or relocation it can turn out to be counterproductive okay if it is not getting the prey then definitely it can turn out to be counterproductive so um, that is with regard to african cheetahs that is why african cheetahs was there in news with regard to this you have to keep in mind to which area or to which location it is being uh, like the proposal is uh, uh, proposing the area in which area it is to be reintroduced it is in the Kuno National Park and about Kuno National Park where it is situated and um, what all are the challenges associated with relocation all these things you have to keep in mind.